We have a double burden of disease. NCDs are adding to the infectious diseases that we have not finished dealing with. There are so many people who are suffering from NCDs globally. NCDs, or non-communicable disease, are those diseases that are developed by our habits that we take across our lives. Diabetes, cancer, cardiovascular disease, and respiratory diseases. Healthcare messages are directed to older people. I believe that we need to put more attention in the children, that we need to put nutrition education everywhere to prevent all these illnesses and all these diseases that are happening around the world. We need young people to know how important it is for them to take care of their health so that they can actually live longer. The One Young World Health Program is an initiative from AstraZeneca to invite young leaders in health and healthcare to come to the One Young World Summit. All kinds of dialogues and roundtables for health and young leadership. It's amazing. We have an incredible opportunity to solve the problem of NCDs over the long term. My name is Ferdinand Bidonyoy. Uh, I am the program manager for the CDC Health Services Non-Communicable Disease Prevention and Control Program, Cameroon, West Africa. In 2007, one of my beloved aunts died from complications of diabetes. I didn't know how dangerous and how difficult it was. And, and so I decided to work on non-communicable diseases. I thought to myself, if I don't work on NCDs, thousands more like my aunt will surely die. Currently, 35% of annual deaths is due to NCDs in Cameroon. While I have the chance, I should be able to do something that prevents deaths from diabetes and other non-communicable diseases. In 2016, we established the Non-Communicable Disease Prevention and Control Program in Cameroon. So far, we have screened more than 50,000 people and done a lot of advocacy. What we're doing is working. The greatest impact is created on the most difficult problems. My name is Mary Mugana. I come from Kenya Kibera in an informal settlement. Uh, I'm a peer educator and a program known as Young Health Program. We focus on getting information to young people to make sure that they're able to make sound decisions when it comes to their health. It's generally a behavior change program that focuses on risky behaviors that expose young people to get non-communicable diseases. I believe like when someone has the correct information, they're able to make sound decisions. So you're really empowering these kids to have skills that help them make those decisions. My name is Edith Soria. I am the Community Relations Coordinator and Nutrition Leader at Create Purpose Mexico. We work with orphan and vulnerable children who are living in orphanages. We implement educational programs with technology, urban agriculture, and nutrition. The healthcare issues the children face is either obesity or malnutrition. They can only feed the children with the foods that they have. The majority of them are canned or ultra-processed foods. With the orphanages themselves, what we're doing is giving them tools so they can make better choices around the food that they give to the children. What I'm trying to take out of this summit is all the experience that the people that are here have from working with NCDs. We have a lot to learn from them. There's a lot of value in the people that are coming. We have a lot of work to do, but we cannot do it alone. And so I'm looking forward to, within this one week, get even more inspired uh, for my work, to get the opportunity to connect with other people's dreams, other people's visions. And this is an incredible uh, opportunity. This is really the space for connecting with the kind of dreams that will elevate you and push you forward.